Hello, EDF friends. I just wanted to quickly share with you um, something cool my EDF friend Gabe Del Toro made um, out of Legos. Um, I think I showed this before where he made the fencer class out of Legos here, which is pretty cool. But he recently finished um, his weapons. He recently finished all the weapons for fencer. I wanted to show those off. Um, as you can see here, he's got the first column. He's got the, the blast twin spear, the spine driver, jackhammer. That thing looks pretty cool. Um, the blasto spear, flashing spear, and then he has all these hammers, the vibro roller, the uh, vibro hammer, Vulcan hammer, quake, quake haken. Ridiculous how, how close these things look. Um, that's the first column he has here. And then he has this column. Uh, let's see, we got, what do we got here? We got the disruptor, we got the galleon armor piercer, the shotgun, and that thing looks pretty cool, I like that. Um, the galleon rapid fire cannon, the hell flame. I really like that Hellflame um, with the with the cable there. Then he has a bunch of Gatlings. Um, apparently there's a bunch of different kinds of Gatlings. The FZ Gatling, the UT Hand Gatling. And then he has, what else? What's over here? Uh, oh, okay, that's, that's still the hammer. So, okay, and then he has some shields here, which is cool. He has a great shield. The... Um, Where's the other one? The ion shield. Pretty nice. Okay, let's go to the next column here now. And then he has, my goodness, he's done all of them. The wild leviathan, <laughs> the phoenix, the bloodstorm, arcane six barrel. If you couldn't tell, he loves a fencer class to put this much time into it. The high altitude missiles. And from my understand, these all fit on the fencer class too that he made, which is really cool. The super heavy crusher mortar, I think looks cool. I like that. The heavy mortars, battle cannon, that looks really accurate. And then the 30 millimeter hand canister. My goodness. This must have took a long time. And then he, he also made a shotgun from uh, Insect Armageddon. I think it looks exactly like it. Unfortunately, the, the shotgun in Insect Armageddon is exactly the most interesting looking weapon. But he did that pretty accurate there. And then he has... Um, He's got. All, he also made some um, some of his own specific weapons he wanted to make that were just you know something he made up himself, like hoping to see an EDF six. So I think these are some. These are some. Yeah, these are some of the other stuff he made. Um, Force pitchfork, uh, the Freedom Dynaforce cleaver, um, and then yeah, the the Grim Reaper scythe. Yeah, these are some of the things he sent me uh, in, in the in the email. Nightmare spear. These are some weapons he made himself. Pretty cool. I'm hoping they'll actually get some more unique weapons for EDF, uh, EDF-6. Grim Reaper Cannon, Automatic Blast Cannon. And then and here's, here's the second set of um, weapons he made up for it. The Behemoth Missile Launcher. The Hellstorm Hunter Missile Launcher. That thing sounds dangerous. Uh, the Rapid Missile Launcher. The beam emitter, the cross beam gun. What does this thing do? The Markalite heat ray projection cannon. I like to fire that thing. But I think that's the last. Pa oh yeah, and then the gargantuan cannon. I think that's the last page. I mean, look. No, there's actually one more. The drill, the super drill, the napalm launcher, potato cannon. <laughs> This is the weapon, this one up here, the um, Severe Thunderstorm Warning, was a weapon he told me to make up, just just make a, a weapon idea. And my weapon was, it would shoot a uh, like a, uh, a ball with that stuck to a chain, and it would, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure what the range I had was, but it would shoot it to the ground, and then you're, you're, you're tethered to that ball, but you can dash around it. But anything that, that, that line that's attached from your gun to the ball... If it hits any enemies, it does shock damage, I believe, and I think it's chain lightning as well to enemies around it. That was my idea for a weapon. And of course, anything you hit with the actual ball itself would, um, I think, one-shot it or do a ridiculous amount of damage because it's hard to aim with it. But that was my idea for a weapon, and I, I think I call it the Severe Thunderstorm. I think that was my idea as well. The Nitrogen Gun. But yeah, I just wanted to share this because I thought it was pretty cool. He put a lot of time into it, and... Uh, and then here's the last one, the atomic ray gun. Looks pretty cool. I like that. But he put a lot of time into it. I just figured it'd be interesting to show you. Actually, there's one more. No. 
uh, the extinction ray blast gun. So yeah, I think that's all. Yeah, so very cool. So uh, you, did, you did a great job, and uh, hope this was interesting to you guys. Figured it'd be interesting to to share with you, and uh, hope to see you in the next video. Thanks a lot.